We are jumping into the kitchen with Angie Boyd. Angie, what are you doing to my diet? Mm. I don't know, but I don't care at this stage as well exactly. because it looks delicious. <laughs> so, so winter time, we know it's nice and chilly and yeah. we like to snuggle up with a nice little hot chocolate and something sweet as well. But you taking the hot chocolate to a complete other level yes. this morning. Hey? One has to, right? Caramelized <laughs> white, white hot, hot chocolate, chocolate. Yeah. with crumb truffles. Yeah. And my tomorrow's goodness. your cheat day, so you can, you can have some <laughs> Today tomorrow. is my cheat day. <laughs> Yesterday was my cheat day. It's okay. Yeah, this is this is definitely not for the faint-hearted. It is a very super sweet hot chocolate. So That's good. So I'm thinking couch duvet movies. Yes. And I'm sure the kids would love to do this. Yes. This is perfect for, for teenagers and kids who like that little bit of extra sweet stuff. Yeah, especially and when it's, it's chilly outside, man. Exactly. Eh? Seeing temperatures in the zeros and minuses <laughs> across the country. So let's. what have you been doing? Okay, what is so that? Okay, so this does take a little time, so I had it going already. Okay. So what it is... is is white chocolate right um obviously better quality is always good yes so we've popped it into a pan and i've just been stirring it the whole time over a sort of a medium My heat and if you can see what's happening it's ca it's sort of caramelizing it's going brown yes it does go a little bit crumbly but we're not going to worry too much about I, that i was about why are you making breadcrumbs yeah for it does look like this <laughs> but you can see it's sort of going brown and, yes. and that adds that caramelly flavor to it right um so it's like caramelizing sugar or car whatever so it's giving you that extra okay. hit of flavor got it and then what we do is so now that it's nice and brown yes you can take it even browner if you want to but we're going to add this milk to it all right and you can see it bubbling. You can see how hot that pan, that yeah. pot is yeah <laughs> and then we're going to just stir it um I don't wanna, i'm not going to add all the milk because i need it to yeah. cook a bit faster is this supposed to dissolve like yeah, completely so this should now dissolve should, okay i'm going to say should dissolve. should dissolve um I don't know how to turn the stove up, so we're just. You want to turn it up? Let me if sort we you can, out. Yeah. There we go. Okay, you the higher grade guy. <laughs> um, <laughs> the tech guy. <laughs> the tech guy. Right. So we've got our milk. We're just going to let it almost come to the boil. That's going to help to melt the chocolate. You yes. are going to still have a few lumps, hence the little sieve that we've got there. Okay. I'm adding a, a little dash of. Vanilla, vanilla extract. Is. You can add other flavors if you want. If you like sort of a coffee flavor, you could add a little spoonful okay. of instant coffee. But vanilla, I think, is the definite yeah. go-to ingredient. And, and then, then we, yes, the condensed yes, milk. Yes, some clover condensed this milk. This is what's going to make it super sweet and delicious. So Oy. I'm just going to add. It's about, about it's about, about a ton. About yeah. a ton. <laughs> sort of equal equal quantities of milk and condensed Look, milk. Look, this actually. is definitely considered <laughs> a, a very very decadent treat. Uh, the keyword is decadent. treat. SMS that to three three seven to eight. That's treat to three three seven to eight. If you want to get your hands on the recipe. Yeah. So now we just dissolve it. So we're just letting that dissolve. Um, right. Let's grab a glass. These are quite nice, aren't yes. they? Yes. Lovely. They're rather pretty. And then we're going to do well, this. Well, I want to see you do that yeah. with, a, with, with, with this. With this tiny little <laughs> serve. All right. Okay. Let's see it. Should, should we serve? <laughs> we'll try. I, I don't know what to do. Oh, oh, look at Angie. Yes. Right. And you can so, see hardly any lumps, eh? They're at the bottom of the pot. So we'll... There we go. And then we're going to just take a little sprinkle of... Thanks, Jan. A little sure. sprinkle of nutmeg over the top. And there's your caramelized white hot chocolate. Wow. Which you're going to enjoy with something else, which is going to make it extra decadent and okay, sweet. Okay, so what have we got there? So here we've got, I've already, we've already done this. So we've got okay. dark chocolate. Let me turn this down quickly. Oh, thank you. Before we burn ourselves. Yes. Um, so we've got the nice dark chocolate. Dark so we're chocolate. looking at our 70% dark. Okay. Got some peanut butter in there, a little bit of butter, and of course some condensed milk. Then we've melted it down and it sort of forms a paste. It's a okay. nice thick paste. And then we're going to add biscuit crumbs. So whatever biscuit crumbs, like the ones I made, I had sort of random biscuits in the cupboard and I yeah. just mixed them all together. So you, you put them in the food processor or if you don't have a food processor, in a yeah. plastic bag and crush it with crush a rolling them. pin. Yeah. Okay, or whatever, you've got a handy, a pot even. Right. And then mix that all together, and then you sort of come up with this truffley mixture, which has got biscuit crumb in it, so you've got that lovely yes, texture. Yes, you've got that texture in there as well. And if you don't want to make them too fine, you can have big chunks of biscuit in there, which is also we nice. We like the chunks of yeah. biscuits, yeah. And you can add your flavors as well. You could add some orange zest, you could add some spices, you know, to go with your nutmeg, you could yes. maybe have a bit of cinnamon or whatever. So you make these little balls now? And then you make little balls, it's that easy. And look at that, obviously yeah. you wait until it's cooled down, and then you you, you kind of dip you them. Dip yeah. them in. So coconut, extra biscuit crumbs, cocoa powder, whatever you've got. Crushed nuts would be quite wow. nice. Wow. And then you've got these, pop them in the fridge to set. 
And there and you have it. Serve bottles. that with yeah. your upgraded hot chocolate, yeah. man, and you, you will be the talk of town. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. The keyword is treat. SMS at 233728. That's treat 233728. It will be on our website as well, expressoshow.com. But this is definitely one way to enjoy <laughs> your hot chocolate. I'm going to tuck into that just now. Angie, thank you very yeah. much. Eh? Cool. <laughs> wow. Sweetness overload in your feel-good breakfast mm -hmm. show this morning. Bring your confectionery to life with Clover Condensed Milk. Made with love by Clover.